This is Anil with a video tutorial for the learning lad on C programming. In this video tutorial, we're gonna see a string function called string length in C. So we can use this string length or string length function to you know find out the length of our string. So first let me tell you the syntax of this string length function. Let me comment some space. Okay, the string length function takes only one parameter. That's gonna be the string to which we want to find the length so we have to specify the string here and the string length function is going to return the integer value or the number of characters present in this string so let's see how we can use it so first we're going to create a character array then we're going to name it as name it's going to store my name here then we're going to assign it with uh, my name a then uh, n then i then l and all of you know that you know a string should be ended with this null character to you know tell this compiler that okay we have read the end of the string so uh, a null character here so then we're gonna use our printf function okay let me create a variable here int okay length now we're gonna use this string length function length equal to then we're gonna call the string length function string length of the string it's gonna be the name array or you know this anil string passed to the string length function you know to find out the length okay we have to remove the n here you know that's because you know this function is called strlen so, okay the next thing we wanna do is just print this length value it's gonna be printf then here we're gonna write uh, the length is percentage d then uh, we're gonna refer this length variable save compile and run so as you can see here the length is 4 you may ask like okay we have the five uh, values here a and i l 4 and then this null character but this string length function is gonna avoid this null character actually this null character is not a string it's just to indicate that you know we have read the end of the string so similarly we can uh, uh, create a string using another method it's gonna be my surname then i'm gonna okay it's gonna be a character array also here we're gonna write in double quotes as uh, shetty so here uh, we're gonna create another variable called uh, length 2 and uh, in this length 2 we're gonna store the length of you know this surname that's gonna be strlen that's the string length function then this surname array so save it and i'm gonna copy this printf statement again and print it here and okay i'm gonna make it the length of percentage s is percentage d it's gonna be name then uh, here also we're gonna do the same thing the length of percentage s is percentage d here we're gonna refer this uh, length 2 here and we're gonna say surname array so save it and uh, compile it using control f9 and run it so as you can see here the length of anil is 4 and the length of shetty is 6 so uh, let me run again for you by adding a new line control f9 and control f10 so the same thing so anil contains four characters and this shetty contains six characters it's gonna be one two three four five six so this is about the st string length function in c and uh, you know this is a really really very helpful function if you are uh, using a for loop to you know iterate over this character array then if you want to find out the length then you can use this string length function so thank you for watching uh, i'll see you in the next tutorial